माय फ्रेंड नमस्कार सो आई वी पी एस एसओ प्री एग्जाम टिप्स एंड इट इज वेरी वेरी गुड इफ योर एग्जाम इज वेरी वेरी सून सो दिस टिप्स आर एप्लीकेबल इफ यू नो द बेसिक थिंग एंड यू हैव गिवन फ्यू मॉक टेस्ट सो लेट सपोज माय एग्जाम इज आफ्टर थ्री डेज लेट सपोज माय एग्जाम इज आफ्टर थ्री डेज और टू डेज वॉट यू हैव टू डू इन लास्ट डेज एंड लेट सपोज माई एग्जाम इज आफ्टर वन वीक सो दिस वीडियो इज वेरी वेरी यूजफुल टू यू so mock test daily you have to give only one mock test only one mock test and more time you have to spend on mock test analysis you have to find out your weak point and you have to find your strong point so you have to improve on your weak point and you have to improve on your uh, you can say strong point by giving less time by giving less time per question per question you have to give less time because the more practice you will do so uh, you can solve the same question less time if you are saving even a 0.5 second 1 second divided by 2 it is also very very beneficial to you now notes do write notes for short tricks short tricks where from wherever you are learning from which uh, teacher or educator or any books author from anywhere you are studying do write your own notes for some specific problem like for a uh, puzzle he is sitting two seats away from me there is only two person gap between me and his floor so there are few statements only a and b are allowed uh, only a and what uh, only few wala kuch statement so some notes you have to write on your own and just before one day exam just before one day exam do revise your notes all the notes it is your english quant reasoning whatever subject you have make do revise your notes in last 2 3 days don't see any video from any educator because if you try to see that video if the method he is teaching you is different in that video and if you want to adopt that new method in last one or two days or three days it will hamper your performance because whatever you have learned in last one year or last six month that is going to helpful in your exam so in last days don't learn anything new whatever you have learned that is enough for you to clear the exam now what you have to do last day sleep for at least 8 hour for at least 8 hour you have to sleep and you have to revise your notes don't give any mock test don't give any mock test in last day in last day don't give any mock test because the mock test you give if your score was not good you will get demotivated and once you get demotivated you will not perform up to the expectation that you are having with yourself in the examination so don't give any mock test in last day last day you have to revise your notes notes of english the english grammar rules you have written the arithmetic shortcuts you have written just revise it and if you want to solve you can solve few questions also you can solve few puzzles also but don't give any mock test don't test your knowledge in last one day and you have a proper sleep and before your examination do eat something do eat something don't go to exam center hungry and don't eat anything that can hamper your stomach also so don't you can eat normal and healthy food i request you do eat healthy food uh, although you eat healthy food i believe and don't eat like pizza burger or any fast food because if you are eating it and by chance that food having you can say some rotten uh, uh, potato or anything if that food hamper your stomach then it will create a problem in your examination the whole year whatever you have spent to clear this examination the preparation that you have done the late night preparation or early day morning preparation it will be ruined so don't do anything stupid in the last day and why sleep because if you feel lazy in the examination you will not be you can say so confident you have to be very very attentive and active in your examination and do think that exam will come easy exam will come easy because 
if you think and if you compare this exam just let's suppose tomorrow is my exam let's suppose tomorrow is my exam so if i'm watching any video which talk about exam level which talk about exam level or if i give any mock test if the exam mock test level is hard or the uh, video which whichever you are watching uh, just before the examination if in the video he told you that exam will come hard so it will become a mindset for you exam will not exam will come hard and it will lose your confidence it will lose your confidence just have a thinking in your mind that exam will come easy and i will easily clear the more attentive you are in the examination that will affect and don't in while giving the exam don't look here and there what he is doing what she is doing just focus on your screen there will be no cheating that i can assure you in ibps exam because all exams are online and everyone is focused towards their exam clearing because they and they are very very you can say attentive to their exam don't think your neighbor will uh, give you any hint regarding any exam because this is a competitive environment let's suppose there is one seat and there are three candidate one you are sitting in middle your one neighbor is sitting left side one is sitting in your right side he will try to get the seat and he will also try to get the seat let's suppose if you ask any question from this neighbor or this neighbor there can be a possibility that they will give you a false answer false negative answer and don't discuss anything before your exam just you can ask the name or which exam you are just a healthy conversation you can have before the examination but don't ask about anything about their preparation or anything that you can say give you a negative impact on your confidence level what you should have a big smile on your face and your confidence level should be very very high and you have to be have a positive attitude in the exam and during the exam also so this was my tip for last uh, week or we can say for uh, na- next day you can say if you are having examination and uh, i wish you very all the best i believe you will easily clear your pre exam and i will see you uh, in your mains exam tips okay guys thanks for watching have a nice day bye bye